tingling? What in cock's name is this? Muttered it your tone. My Please tell me this is Brooks, mom. Jesus Christ. Please let it be so. It makes perfect sense. She ain't a slack, but she's definitely a slack, Joe. <laughs> How's it going people? Jack here with another reaction to Haunted Parenting. This is chapter 4, Feud of Our Fathers. I have listened to all the audio logs for Haunted Parenting except for the one with the introduction to the World of Darkness where the villains, I guess, are talking about it. Uh, but uh, the one with the 99p store, at least the two episodes that had to do with that. Uh, <laughs> were hilarious. Look, it got so bad to a point where I even started having sympathies for Giles, uh, one of uh, Brock's friends? Lackeys. Lackeys is the right word to use here. D is quite the specimen. <laughs> How he quite literally turned into a Karen until he was faced with an actual Karen and could not have any good rebuttal. That was very interesting. <laughs> Oi! Uh, I came here with 99 pence on the dot to prove a point! But I unthinkingly used a pence to check the depth of that pit. Uh, dreadfully sorry. I'll... I suppose I'll put this back. Trying to ensnare somebody with some verbal mumbo jumbo just so that you can get your hands on a blender for 99p which they don't sell at a 99p store but still he went there went through orangutans or whatnot lost species <laughs> this guy's writing is golden so i have nothing but high expectation for this episode here now all of you have told me that uh, this one is fire so uh let's check it out Oh, what do you know? <laughs> the Yowie paddle. Elise, Grim, Grimmel, and... Oh boy, I forget. There is an imposter in this chapter house! You lie! <laughs> Contemptible deceiver! I did not boy. come as your foe, Black Law! You're always my foe, D. Since the time our ancestors quarreled from our first breath, we are enemies! Now fall! Ah! you broke it! Legal excuse to crop! No shot, Let's go! Boyfriend! What the hell? What do I do? Get the chance! Dude, Dor and his son are awesome. <laughs> Nobody can handle them. I I, I want to bet that they could actually be taking Broke and his uh, lackeys. Just the two of them. I mean, one of them has a desert eagle, if I'm not mistaken. All right, right, that was the gun that uh, the, the the son used in the last. In the last one. And also, can we just talk about how awesome the animation is? What in the vampiric hell happened? I love this. Uh, if you both agree. Suppose all's in order, but why'd so much of the budget go on Wigan Kebab? She <laughs> Like Oda Nobunaga, it was a great unifier of bomb cakes. Wow. So you liked it? Liked it? I threw up! Welcome! Trouble downstairs! Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit! See? Ma! <laughs> Bloody... Each other. <laughs> 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 
competitive asphyxiation. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Spiritus Vitae. Oi! Stop killing spit! <coughs> Why did Elise just join in there? <laughs> For no reason. Jesus. I mean Jesus! This Marachi broke through the window and my hedge. Execute them immediately! Nothing is broken. Belgian. I unattached the window frame. <laughs> In truth, our only crime was assault! <laughs> Why was I not born in Nokia Engage? Like... <coughs> oh. What part of banishment and exile did you not cop onto? Mm, both parts. You'll actually be glad we broke in, Chancellor. <laughs> okay, no, not engaging. Leave. You're already engaged. I never signed our divorce papers. <laughs> okay, okay, what? Well, well, it was pre-established that they had several boyfriends. So it is not coming as a surprise. But what the fuck? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, oh, my brain! Leave! Well, wait, uh, Chancellor, we have important information obtained on our last hunt. You're still hunting? There is a mole in your chapter house, Occam. A mole? More specifically, a vampire blood slave. A ghoul. Yeah. Can't have that. You have proof. A blank body we captured informed father. Uh, his name was Kevin. Ah! This Kevin could be an amphetamine supplier for all we know! <laughs> Not likely! Occam knows my suppliers all too well. <sighs> I don't even think that it... Oh, they're taking him seriously. Oh, well, that's great. Because it is a serious matter. God, door is so big. Fellow Arcanists, my apologies for this urgent music. Let's see here. Reinstalling the window Chancellor, frame. <laughs> can you confirm the presence of everyone who's been here in the past year? Excluding members on exchange, these are our active members. Chancellor, my diagnosis is that this is hogwash. <laughs> oh boy. Same shit, different day. Mind your tone, laborers. Oh no. I too am a bit curmudgeonly after rising from my evening siesta. Arcanists, we have reason to believe there's an infiltrator in the chapter house. A ghoul. A servant of the vampiric powers that be, seeking highly sensitive data in our archives. This individual poses a threat to us. And to make matters worse, they may be in this very room. God, I absolutely love the effect that he have on animation, especially while talking. While it isn't outright as expressive as a would-be direct interpretation of the facial movements, it is unique in its own way, like they're moving accordingly to, to I guess, the uh, the vowels that are being said and stuff. It's, uh, it's unique. I love it so much. Um, hey, Rick. And the expressions okay. are still coming Show through. Your condom license when announced. Harry Jacket, Neophyte. Elise Culpepper, neophyte. Wait, what the hell? Br brother Elise Culpepper. <laughs> and phylogical research. What? She's studying fairies. Giles Oakling and Simon Spires, part-time security. Yeah. Brocken Blacklaw, security. Grimaline Smith. Grimal Kunchama. Neophyte. Dr. Gloria Waters, Lord Wernon Fatigue. Woman Fatigue. Whoa. Matilda Wilde, Amanda Bergamot, the hell. <laughs> Come on. And for our most senior leadership, I am Remold Black. I am Big D. 
No, he has a driving license of Kevin. Ah, oh, you idiot. Why? Why did he... I, I suppose that he doesn't have an ID since he was excommunicated, right? Yes, yeah, still, why did you use that? Be shelter like the master hunter father! Grandfather! Occam's esteemed uncle! Occam's beloved ex! Enemy of D and his vile hit. Reviled victim of the Black Lord despots! And Giles! You served me as an IG9 peace store that one time! Hi! It's my day job! <laughs> I didn't know it was Rage dead. Hope you suffer. No discounts for you, Raid! Bitch. Uh, go ahead, Johnson. <laughs> Bitch. Occam O'Connell, Chancellor of the Arcanum Chapter House of Great Yarmouth. And that's everyone. Can this blue buffoon even write? Only in cursive, mate. What a backhanded compliment, Grimaldi. Oi! I just went to bat for you, you Grimaldi. Hi. Hi. Save the energy for a canon debate. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, good. No enemy, please. <laughs> God, I love those designs. Look at them. This is Eliphas's work, right? Dude, I, I need... To, I, I think I follow him on Twitter. But, wow. It's beautiful. The geriatric Cold War's enough. Harry Leg thinks this is a Cold War. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> killing it, Ma. Shut it, Slackjaw! Assuming you can! Quiet! <laughs> <sighs> So, for those of you not in the know, vampires are real. Sorry you had to find out about it this way. What we're dealing with, however, is a ghoul. The blood of the vampire acts as a potent narcotic to the living. Get a good mouthful and boom, you're a ghouled blood slave. But, like any narcotic, if one goes long enough without, they might find themselves experiencing very nasty, very visible side effects. Withdrawal symptoms. Yeah. Which brings us to our next order of business, the lockdown. Except... <laughs> uh, don't panic. We came prepared. <laughs> Best part of construction. Destruction. Do not penetrate this barrier. Instead, have spawned with the golden goose, lest we become enthralled in traffic lock! <laughs> oh, and we'll no. be back, Father. We installed the second deck machine guns for nothing. Now, now, boy. Oh. The M60s will have their day. Let's get Otellis. <laughs> Okay, listen, listen, listen. <clears throat> we cannot avoid drawing comparisons to the earlier works of Bruva and company when it came to if the Emperor had a Texas space device, wherein Dor was of course Rogel Dorn, who is known for fortifying more than actually destroying. Now, I love that the Sage Master this time around, uh, the person who is willing to break things down, <laughs> is well him and with an m60 for his son <laughs> hold on let let me move my face here for a little bit and look at the glee on his son's expressions wow perfect return to your seat d the black laws take charge i cannot allow this you have no voice here Hockham. You cannot allow this! Occam is a black law and shall not be swayed by you pia! I've never met a homosexual I couldn't sway! Occam, <laughs> listen to me! No, listen to me! Hockham, for the love of all that's no, good, you must listen, listen to, to me! me. You you listen to this! 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 Listen you aren't in charge. How dare you? Aha! You aren't in charge. Aha! How dare you? This is my chapter house. And I think, oh, yes, we're doing it my way, Kurivmila Mahagat. <laughs> D, you've interacted with vampires the most, despite it, you know, being forbidden. Anything important you'd care to share? When we find the ghoul, prepare to fight. 
If we work together, and with me at the helm, we will hogtie this ghoul within a minute of its reveal. Si, seulement. <sighs> if only. Lastly, I speak to you now, ghoul. Whoever you are. We will find you. It's only a matter of time. I can't know if you chose to become a traitor, or if it was forced upon you. But you are among those who call you friend and colleague. If you are forced to betray us, I implore you, resist! Come forward. We'll do all we can to help you. <laughs> but if this is a path you have chosen, if you're not a victim, but a traitor, you'll answer to me. And that answer will come in flame. Absolutely love the small detail there with Brock not sitting on the same chair as the others, as a callback to what we heard in the audio log with his uh, personal stool that is a family heirloom. But he's so big. <laughs> we solve this now. Come with me. <laughs> After eons, we witness the unsealing of the archives. Ooh. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. The nun. Who the fuck are they employing? Jojo characters? <laughs> I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm, I'm, I'm a huge fan of uh, muscular women, but <laughs> it still took me aback a little bit. <laughs> Ooh. Well, this is where the ghoul would strike. Anything worth stealing is here, including your names, your locations, your personal details. And none but you can get in. Remold, Dr. Waters, Lord Fatigue, they also have archive access. Oh, oh. splendid. If it makes it any easier, there are no other entryways. Now, the chapter cave, house has man. many secret corridors, but none of them lead here. That better be the case! If that ghoul gets out, no fox hunters will be the hunted! You know, D. You're the reason we collected this info. The Coalition demanded data on Norfolk's hunter activity because of your so-called reckoning. The Coalition, pah! You know what Kevin and his ilk call this newfangled movement? The Second Inquisition. And that's exactly what those jack-booted upstarts are! You sold us out to a menagerie of government stooges, private interests, and play pretend Templars! I trust big government over Big D any day. <laughs> Why don't you marry him then? <laughs> Find me a prime minister more virile than me! I wait! <laughs> Mate. Not only do I get to return to the chapter house, but you get to enter the archive! Oh. Never thought he'd wind up here, huh? What is with the clown chair? That's straight up like a Junji Ito kind of thing, like the, the, the person who lives in the chair, like the rib cage and everything. Ugh. You get to enter the archive! Oh. Never thought he'd wind up here, huh? Just hoped it'd be uh, under. Better circumstances. God, it's a shame, that, but bang a party. Though. Why are you talking at us? Hey, Sorry, they, which one are not friends? <laughs> oh, yeah, man, I'm spit. <laughs> I just got hired, like. Mate. You're, you're Brock's minion. <laughs> like, my nemesis. You think you're better than me? You're not better than me! I'm Spit! Everyone knows Spit! You know me! Get off me! No, you are better than me! Why are we even alive? I need to get out of here! Aww. He's at a riddle. Marty! Quit chatting up me, boys! I'm trying! Another round? What are we doing? Well, how else to find a blood slave? A blood test. Oh. Take a goblet, fill it with a few drops. Dr. Waters, I assume you have sanitized instruments for our use? You think I just carry scalpels in my doctor's bag every day? <laughs> for everyone. 
foot. <laughs> the Arcanum syllabus states we are not to engage with these head. <laughs> scholars, not judges, not hunters. But I deem this ruling moot when our security is imperiled. With that, I have a method to unveil our mole. And for that, you need blood. Bang on! Such satanic nonsense. Solar sorcery satanic. is an ancient and hallowed art remeld. By my touch, the ghoul's blood will betray itself. And as you've decided to insult the technique of my homeland, I'll take your blood first. <laughs> Wait, Say to me, please, my own blood, and I'm not here for that. Oh, that one's mine, like. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> For why I brought you in here, carry this out. What is that? The cold tessellation. We throw in the suspect in that box? Correct. Its nature is sorcerous and escape is near impossible. Once our ghoul is captured, it will help us resolve this. Now, out. I'll begin my rights. Remember to stay close. Carrying the box will be a cooperation trial. Succeed, and I am sure we can make this work. We will do, do it. it. Oh, oh, oh my God! <laughs> Why it is so dumb? Can't you set your rivalries away for but a second? Shit. I said follow, follow my lead. Catch up didn't even help! My legs were shot with a gun! My kneecaps were compressed by a car crush. Don't see me whining! We're doomed. He can't take you, mate! Please stop. By the way, it's not a sex panel! This is not I the time you, to start mingling this. This is a... Weren't we well, supposed to prepare to fight the, this, uh, ghoul fella? Oh, I'm still processing the vampires are real. Well, uh... How, in the kitchen. I do. How come you not know you're working for a manor that is full of paraphernalia that alludes to the damn thing? How could you not know? You have some uh, reading to uh, attend. Uh, maybe uh, don't split up. Uh, damn. Why is a dog in a slug fighting again? We're living past trauma. Like skull trauma? <laughs> Let me scowl. Oh no, oh no. <coughs> oh, if an old man lends you an ear, Simon. I don't want your ear. I want me bloody ear to quit ping ponging. All day is like, oh, I party, and then it's like nightmare, freak out. I uh, can't make it decide on nothing. <laughs> Which voice seems more correct? This party ain't great. Freak out voice is spawn. Doesn't want you to freak out about something big. It's me, big light. Excuse me if I don't exactly tell you what. Can this big thing by chance be compartmentalised? What? M made smaller. More manageable. M maybe. Then, like scrubbing a bathroom floor, you do it one tile at a time, lad. <laughs> like me day job. How about we take a moment and work on it? Elise! Elise! Fine, innit? We could head for the bar in the other room. Ew. Much quieter there. Come, lads. Uh, hope it ain't him, Mark. That gives like a toffee prod on human form. <laughs> I'm feeling the event about that. Excuse the fuck me. Oh, just well sure you and Mark have been enjoying the freedom since you left the Arcanum. There was no leaving. I was kicked out. Okay, fine. You, you know what I mean. You haven't had to conduct any research under the gaze of some wheezer geezer like Remmel. You are abso-fucking-lutely correct, Grimaline. I haven't. I haven't conducted any research because I no longer have the Arcanum's funds to conduct them with. Sure, it's on your own, Bob, but you ain't got no bloody oversight. You should be happy. Oh. They used to date, didn't they? They used to fuck. <laughs> didn't they <laughs> okay yeah yeah it the, the tension is right there this is exactly why we never worked out oh, 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 
boy! Between your obliviousness, your obsessions, the fist of the North Star music looping all night. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Look, I, I can't take any more of you right now. Hey, wait. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. No, just... <sighs> oh, Grimaline. It's all right. <sighs> Grimo. Not the best outcome. Sorry, Mark. Uh, I'll find her. I've uh, got some weights in storage. You want to go lift, Mark? Yeah, <laughs> with my teeth. Core day for you, laddie. Let's pump that stress up. Pump. We'll meet with Grimo when she's not being... An insincere bugler! <laughs> and that's the least I can say of that D. So, what's the plan, Pop? Like on one of my werebear safaris, I want you on high alert and to shoot on sight. Whoa, is that the old man when he was younger? Because if it is, goddamn. Metaphorically, of course. <laughs> now. <laughs> Games were werebears? To hell with the were beasts, boy! D is after something in the archive. That mountain lion. And uh, where'd speak do, by the way? Well, he's off on an errand for Giles, wasn't that right? Yeah, I uh, drop my keys, uh, uh, wallet, and, uh, uh, smokes. Uh, he said he knew what I might have dropped him, so I told him about it. Alright, uh, I'll go fetch him myself. Right. Uh, speaking of smoke, that day did come off all suspicious like when he harangued me at the 99p store. Yeah, what's that about? I was on the register when he came in. Excuse me. Excuse me. Hey. Excuse me. Animated. He started chatting me up real pushy-like. It didn't introduce himself as D. He said his name was Kevin, he did. You can just call me Kevin. <laughs> I fucking knew it. Now he's gonna come and bite, biting him back in the arse. Oh. D. <laughs> he said his name was Kevin? Yeah. Sir Diable. They said he got his info from a blank body named Kevin. That's it. It's so evident now. This is all a front to steal from our archives. This is all a ploy. What do we do? Crump him bloody? We can end D once and for all. We just need proof. An admission to present to Occam. And I know just how to get one. Uh-oh. <sighs> okay, Gremel and Kitten originally met at a rave held at Soul Folk's anime convention. Of course they did. The fact that both are now blacklisted from the Soul Folk's convention scene is a direct consequence of this meeting. Uh-oh. This was seen as a positive outcome, for both parties now had fewer reason to ever go to Soul Folk. <laughs> Hoppy Hoffman. For free! No! And more! Oh, I should have gone with them to the funny phrenology library. You! Yes, you! Are you looking for the perfect servant to defend you from the encroaching darkness? <laughs> Don't you dare turn me into a marketable plushy mortal! No shorts. Ah, and so do I. This lad loves you. He comes with a holy blessing and will keep you safe. What has she done? Give it! This unique collector's plush figure by taking part in a crowdfunding campaign. If 200 units are sold, production will start and the plush will soon serve in your. Psychotic identity feed! You're playing in life for 21 days, so take your shot. Yeah! For after this, the plush will be banished to the umbral depths, never to be I seen. I curse Yay. you! I curse you! Die! I'm killing you with my powerful wizard gun! I'm sick! $29.99 US dollar plus shipping with international shipping to most countries from $19.99 US dollar. Begin your lonely servant now! <laughs> Okay. Oh, 
Well, Elise has now access to. Sorry, just fuming. Mind fuming elsewhere. Cat dishes to sort, you know. Very oh, unsociable. Oh God, I'm sorry. I'll find somewhere fumeless. Security rooms, the most ventilated room in the building. Also, I'm not in it. Ventilated sounds nice, but I've got no clearance. We could let you in. But will you? Um, no, still your own keys. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Why are you all back? Uh, to find the <laughs> ghoul? It meant more along the lines of, why is it your problem? I'm a hunter. <laughs> Listen, lad, you seem... Nice. Oh, he is nice. Whatever. Him. It's like a soft pillow. Whatever. <laughs> Between the cocaine doctor, Remold, his pighead son, the son's yeah, dancing yeah. monkeys. I know, I know. Don't get me wrong. <sighs> Pay's good. Yeah, just not good enough. And now we're stuck here. On overtime. Unpaid overtime. Oh. My sympathies. You don't know the half of it. Well, hey, I mean, this is a desperate measure. The ghoul really that bad? Think it will cost me my job? It might. Let us pray. Can't be helped then. Easy on the hunter thing, okay? No promises. <laughs> Cheers. If you need anything else, ask Amanda. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're nice. Oi, Elise. It's me. Where's everyone? Well, uh... The Jojo Bird is back! We can eat it again! <laughs> Finally. Uh, sir, I've read that article. It originates from a 19th century conspiracy magazine. That's the Holy Creation magazine! It's the paraphrased word of God! <laughs> Creationist. <laughs> Creationist! That's it! The Balaki goes in the box! <laughs> They're fighting again? No, he was lifting! What are we <laughs> Marty! Where've you been? Here! Suspicions. Hawking's been gone for three tire changes, almost a length at two football games, and so has you, co winky dink Who measures time like that? Yeah. Hours? Have you heard of hours? He's got a point. Hawking should have been done by now. We can go check on him. I'm checking on him. Say you are. Come with. Clever lad. Me eyes are on you, Red. Ah, come open oh, up! Bully! Bully! Nothing. Are we not loud enough? Bloody, just crack it open like a can. He could also just be hard at work with his rich. Get your filthy hands off me! In a moment! Ha <laughs> ha! Those are mine, Lummox! Is, is that? Not much of a ward if you could break the lock with brute force. <laughs> Cheers, that. Is the Badlands violence advisable? Oh, heavens forbid! I really should think more about my career! <laughs> 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 Thank you! Chancellor oh, no. Damnation! Bloody hell! Oi, lightweight! Wake up! Is he breathing? Let me check. Unconscious, but alive. See the marks around the neck? He was choked out, probably from behind. The hell is going on in here? We heard a commotion. Oh, shit. Piss! The ghoul must have our data. Every hunter in Norfolk is compromised. The coalition won't take kindly to this. Our chapter house status is at risk. Shit! We should have just sat in a circle till Ockham was done. <laughs> Why didn't we do that? Oh, you're all a bunch of idiots. God, you're right. The constant fighting's distracted us. All right. 
Who went unaccounted for after our exit from the archives? Who could have attacked Occam as we were leaving? All of you. Reddened. Hmm, I wonder why. Oh, it was you, Amanda, Mr. Marcus, Dr. Waters, Lady Lise, uh, Mr. Spires, Mr. Oakling, Grimalk and Charmer, and myself were not tasked with carrying. As uh, Blacklaw put it, it was a job only fit for the fittest of men. Another thrilling fuck up from the old guard. Silence, trumpet! You are a suspect! What the fuck I am? Stop fighting! Stop fighting! I'm not buckling at all! Come on, Equation Shinja! We're likely dealing with forces <laughs> greater than I had hoped. What do you mean? It may well be that the ghoul has used its. <sighs> Disciplines <laughs> to Magic. orchestrate this. Disciplines? That's vampire magic. In a sense, yes. Our ghoul may have inherited dangerous abilities through their master's blood. Inhuman strength, sharpened senses, even the power to bend minds. Not to mention whatever sorcerers know how they may possess from either the Arcanum or their dark master. And you thought to mention this now? It wasn't relevant till now! Yes, it was! Baby is quiet! Uh, line up, all of you! My interrogation skills will unravel this! Do not listen to Dee's drivel! He is behind this! Oh, that's rich coming from someone with archive access! Elise! Huh? You first! The rest stays! Sir D, we can't split up again! We are in- You're literally walking away! Stay! Marcus, we have to keep order before everyone- I'm not letting him bong waterboard Elise! Uh, wait! <laughs> Amanda. Yeah? Okumi is out of commission for the moment. Mm -hmm. um, yes, that's true. So guess I gotta take charge. Harry, Matilda, bring Occam to his office right now. Let's go. Chop, chop. Stop uh, splitting up! Uh, I'll be back. Less talking, more pulling! Shit! Who's left? Me? Splitting up must be in the new fashion. Fantastic! Uh -oh. And get spit fatigue. Oh! And rum- Made! The loyalists, you come with us. Uh, no! Now, Fuck. do not panic. I was looking for Grimmel at the time. <laughs> Father, <laughs> stop <laughs> this man! <laughs> okay, I just want to say I do not trust old man Fatigue or Fatigue. He is, he is somewhat sus, and the only reason why I'm saying that is because that he is a new introduction to all this, and he seems way too calm about any of that. So, yeah, uh, watching enough anime uh, gets my spider senses tingling when the one normal person might likely be the culprit. Anyways, D uh, looking fancy, I guess. Madness! What are you doing? I'm interrogating, fool! You're getting your hair done! So? You... You're not torturing Elise? Helsing's heart, no! <laughs> what amateur would resort to torture at a time like this? Blacklaw! <laughs> your conductivity is suspiciously high. Blacklaw! Conductivity. Marcus. Point down! Get me out of here! Let's go! Tingling? What in cock's name is this? Moderate your tone! My Please tell me this is Brooks, Mom. Jesus Christ. Please let it be so. It makes perfect sense. She ain't a slack, but she's definitely a slack, Joe. <laughs> My polygraph is sensitive. <sighs> That's no lie detector. That's a car battery. There's no time to be lost. Let's move! Ow! She's a live wire! The brains of me pa's polygraph. It zaps you until the truth leaks out. And the longer it don't... <laughs> Rock's face looks like a baboon's ass! <sighs> Sweet relief. Oh, you fry for that one, fishy. Son-in-law! Sir D! Remind me to educate you on the basics of bare knuckle beatdowns! It ain't that easy, old-timer. Your papa could never take a punch like that. <laughs> Impressive. Hey! <laughs> ah! <laughs> 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 
ready to give up. <laughs> you have potential, boy. Why waste it? The only thing I'm wasting is you, geezer. Well then, may the best geezer win. This is all a ploy, a front to steal from our archives. <laughs> Oh god, you're alive. You <laughs> want me. God! Uh, damn it! Uh, oh god! Uh, 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 Ooh! Yeah. Right in the family jewels. Uh, 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 now you see, Bravado won't save you. Hey, save her. <laughs> L'Enfer! I know you attacked Arkham D! Or should I call you... Kevin? What? Kevin? Behold! How did you get that? Oh! I pilfered it from your pocket, Kevin Wetsworth! I pilfered that from the blank bottle! Dad, why are you carrying the wizard's driver's license around? It's a free, unused identity! Because it is! Look! The same! Indisputable! You and your spawns are the culprits! That's not all. I interrogated the cook to see if she was in on your scheme. The, uh, test was inconclusive. She was clearly lying! I'll get Dr. Waters. Wait, Elise! You don't know how sweaty she left that harness. Probs while I'm still a uh, golden is meant is, innit? Hobbycock! A man that never sweats. She's lower class. Oh, Just like D. Enough! Shut the fuck up! Yes! Troubled Black Law! Your polygraph is broken! I'll kill you, D! Bring it on, Black Law! <laughs> fuck! So dumb! Marcus! Grimmel! Brock! Yeah, what do you want? We have to stop all of this bloody fighting! This is asinine! Says you! We's busy solving the case! Oh, shut up! I've never a clue where anyone is, and all you manage to do is fry poor Amanda! The ghoul might be escaping at this very second! Oh, yeah. I'm just doing what my pa wants me to get this barmy investigation over with. And don't try to fool me! It's you lot who are the... How about you just use the few brain cells that you have left? Uh, ghouls. What was that? Uh -oh. Upstairs. Oh, bloody hell! Move, dickhead! Upstairs! Move, move, move! Go! <laughs> 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 Oh no, Spitz. <laughs> oh no. Whichever one of you did this, you won't see the morning. Wait, so if it isn't the old guy, the, the, the lady doctor, maybe? What the fuck? Is it Spit? He heard voices, perhaps like on command, he can't control himself and just has to do the the commands of his master. Holy shit. Okay, that was intense. God, that's so good. I can't... <laughs> I want to say that in almost every single frame there were easter eggs somewhere there. 
for something important? That Carl mumbling something. Okay. <laughs> An RL segment as always. What's he doing? <laughs> the random rhomboids being employed there as a filter. Fish islands for the win. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> but why? <laughs> why? For some reason. What the fuck? That was some John Clee shit. <laughs> Monty Python will be proud. Okay, this one was one hell of an episode. <laughs> From the animation alone, which they ramped up to an amazing degree, to the dialogue and everything working so well together. Wow. Oh my god. I'm, I'm expecting Door in the next one to sling that uh, M60 and his son just going amok. That would be great. I love what they did with Orkham. He's uh, obviously Irish. <laughs> with the way that he enunciated and of course the spells that he ended up using. Uh, what is this? Call it Old Celtic Magic or something that the D said. Also, D's prize in combat. Not to be, uh, not to be dismissed. Jeez, uh, duty strong. Well, my suspect uh, got blown up, so yeah, I have little to no idea who this might be. The lady there who had the scalpels uh, could be, but I don't, I don't know. Uh, could she have been the reason as to why Arkham got actually knocked out? There might be multiple sub uh, suspects here, but we'll see eventually when the next episode releases. But anyways guys, thank you so much for checking out this video. As always, please do make sure to go and subscribe to Alpha Boozer. And of course, if you like this reaction, don't forget to hit that like button. And uh, that being said, we should all have a wonderful day. Stay away from the shadows and see you guys in the next one. Bye.